I'm going to talk about scanning the legs today um, to have a look at the blood vessels supplying the blood down to the feet. Um, a patient would typically arrive at the reception area, have a seat in the waiting room and get called through for their ultrasound exam. And when they enter the room, they'll be greeted by the sonographer performing the test. There's a separate changing cubicle in each room for the patient. Um, depending on what test is being performed, you may be asked to change into a pair of shorts. Um, once the patient is changed into the appropriate um, attire, um, the patient will then be asked to lie down on the ultrasound bed. Um, and the technologist performing the scan will explain the procedure, where they're going to be looking, what they're going to be looking at, and what happens with the patient's results uh, following the exam. And for a leg arterial ultrasound scan, we start at the groin for each patient, and then we basically follow the leg down to the ankle. And we're going to be applying some jelly, and we're going to be taking pictures at multiple levels, it's basically to ensure that we're imaging all of the blood vessels as we need to, and um, making the most appropriate diagnosis. The majority of our tests are actually um, performed on the legs and it's for patients who've got pain when they're walking, numbness, tingling, um, cold sensation in their legs or non-healing wounds. Um, so we perform an ultrasound scan looking directly at the blood vessels in real time to assess for any narrowings or any blockages. And our vascular interventional radiologists will do a really detailed written report and because we are such a small team with relatively low numbers of patients, um, your referring physician will get the patient results within 24 hours. So it's a very quick turnaround in terms of getting the patients their results. 